Hello there and good day everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Truly Bedrock. I hope everyone's doing fantastic. I am doing amazing here in my bedroom. So um, I've been hard at work the last couple of hours just working and decorating the first floor of our mansion. Well, just this bedroom anyway. Um, and I'm absolutely happy with it. I'm so happy with it. We have our armor here for our... Uh, you know our armor on the go and then of course we want to store anything there I believe I have a couple of swords in there just some random items um, nothing else in here too special but the bed the bed is the coolest thing of all because there's actually a bed underneath there uh, with a little blanket and of course you can go ahead and actually sleep in here and it does completely work so here we are all tucked away in our lovely little bed all right so then there you go so the bed is actually in there so it's you know it's truly functional we have a little um like a place to clean our faces in the morning we have a sink um, <laughs> and then of course um over here we have this treasure map that i have yet to explore we may actually go uh looking for some treasure later on um, and then of course we just have some decorative stuff, some shelving. This is my favorite painting, which I never seem to get, the one of the wither, uh, which is pretty cool. And so, um, oh yeah, and of course I decorated it in here. Uh, but I'm really happy with the way this interior has uh, kind of come all together. Um, so the last thing I want to do, or, or one of the things I would like to do, is I'd like to decorate this room. Now, I did say I wanted to dedicate this room to Di Diamond Alliance members. So we're going to have to get in on that. We're going to have to decorate in here. Now, I would like to have two additional beds, but I think for the meantime, I'll have one bed there uh, for whoever comes by. Anyways, it'll be pretty much the same design. This is my favorite uh, bed design by far. Okay, so if you're curious as to how I built this bed, all you got to do... Um, of course, we're going to make it three wide so we can actually fit, um, let's see, one, two, three, so we can actually put a bed here, okay? So there's that, and then this is going to go, oops, let's try that again, this is going to go here, and then that goes there, that simple. Uh, and then of course we're going to put our bed there. Now we do need some magenta magenta something uh let's see any kind of block magenta will work we could even use um the concrete but i think i would much rather use wool so let's try that um let's see is there any here oh perfect okay cool so then it's going to make a little bit of carpet now magenta beds are cool i don't know why i was going to do white i first initially thought to do white but magenta is nice also so let's just go like so whoops put this on top there we go kind of randomly place that uh, let's see well let's go like that and then go like so there we go all right so now we have our magenta bed now let's go ahead and let's see how did I make this again oh yeah all right so we're gonna go like that that's gonna go here that's gonna go there this goes like so, and then we need a slab um, on top of this. There we are. All right, so now that that bed is all complete, I wanna go ahead and throw in a little area rug. Again, we're gonna go with the white rug because it just looks good, and we can also make it look like maybe some kind of an animal print. Okay, so this can go here, and then this will go there. Let's do crafty bench there and then it'll go like that very good okay so there's some storage here if they want to put their stuff away um and then of course we'll put this in there because that just always looks good you know i don't think i want that there books are going there later okay armor stand i'll put up top there and there and there and i'm gonna say like <laughs> I treat maybe the um, this is a it's a guest room but I also kind of treat it like a storage so it'd be kind of funny to have like barrels everywhere so it's a storage slash a guest room for the Diamond Alliance members so let's just do that there we go 
<laughs> oh, that's pretty hilarious. Okay, um, let's see. We'll throw that back in there. Oh, lanterns. We need lanterns. And, uh, let's try and craft up those bookshelves. Let's try and craft those up. I need a crafting bench. Oh, hello. <laughs> Alright, so we've got a bookshelf here. We can put one in. Yeah, I think one will be fine. And then have this going, like, so, I guess. Yeah, that looks okay. And then just for decorative purposes, we can do that. And then we can throw a chest right there. Perfect. So put, you know, items in there. So um, I need to see, I need to find out if I have, I gotta have like a flower or something. <laughs> um, let's see, let's grab, uh, well, we can put oxide daisies in there, I guess. That's probably gonna be the best bet. Oxide Daisy, Oxide Daisy. That's pretty good. And then, let's see, Sea Pickles are good. There we go. Couple of candles there. Couple of candles there. Very good. And let's just put this. Do I want to put that on top of there? No. Let's put that right here. Okay. Let's see, we have lanterns here that we need to place. So we can place a lantern. Let's see, hello Discord. Uh, let's just throw this on top. And then we can throw a lantern. We gotta get rid of that. Throw a lantern there. There we go. And then maybe one more barrel here with another lantern on top. Very good. All right. <clears throat> so, nice use of lanterns here. Um, and now all we're going to do is grab some armor. I should have, I hope, anyway. Um, if not, maybe we should craft some up. And right now, leather is something I do have, actually. Let's see. Mob drops. Okay, yeah. I should have plenty of leather here to make leather armor. All right. Last bit of the armor here. Let's see. Pants for you. Pants for you. And then you need everything else. Okay, cool. All right, so all the armor stands are filled out. And I love it. I think it looks cool. Not really, like I said, not a lot to it. Kind of want to break this so I can put a lantern here. Let's see. Let's see. If we break these, we can put lanterns there. <gasps> Ooh, I think I like the lantern there better than the fence. That is for sure. So, speaking of decorating, speaking of that, I got together with Foxy um, a couple of weeks ago. We did some incredible decorating together. Um, <laughs> a lot of shenanigans. Um, definitely a fun little collaboration on the, the uh, I was going to say the city hall, uh, <laughs> but that's not quite it. Um, on the, uh, the town hall, rather, for truly bedrock so um i have some footage over there or a footage of some fun stuff that we did over there some shenanigans of building but uh, i think for the most part we are done with the decorating over here that did not take too much time it definitely did help that i already had that part decorated over there uh, but definitely loving the way this is all coming together so um i'm gonna let you guys check out the footage of me and foxy decorating and kind of uh, show you guys the um, amazing job we did over there and then we'll head back over here and uh, get into some other stuff There are a few more things that I'd like to get into so anyways, I'll be uh, right back Well all, all of the oh go on. Yeah, I was gonna say so <laughs> sorry. Um, so you said the center here. This is gonna be kind of the uh, What we'll be meeting do you want to? Yeah. build like a, a round table or <laughs> I, don't know. I thought about that, but it's going to be difficult to get 15 chairs around a round table. So, and also I've told them this sort of awkward slabby thing, which probably needs dropping down another level. I mm -hmm. kind of wanted it so that when we came in through these T-shaped arches or T-shaped doors, we would drop down a bit. But I think I've probably not done the best. Hmm. I don't think I've left enough room. Um... What if we had like uh, like some greenery in here? Would you have like some plants or something in here? Or no, that is that good. too? Okay. No, that would be good. I was, a, do you know, before you ripped the floor up, I was <laughs> trying a few times with um, like little ponds in the middle. 
mm-hmm. like tr- trying to have flowing water and stuff like that, but I just couldn't make it work. So. Oh, flowing water. Yeah, that sounds it's a great idea. Thanks. Make it look a little bit organic. Because with it, well, I was getting it, looking over at what you've done next door and I was thinking, oh, that's amazing. How can I bring some of that into this? Yeah, I could totally, I don't know, like, I know a lot of people don't like a lot of plants everywhere but um if you're if you're up to that idea i could totally do something similar yeah. to that yeah dig it all out get rid of it start again <laughs> <laughs> are you watching me build <laughs> this is what i'm no, doing <laughs> no, is that what you're doing is it? <laughs> yes no, that's exactly what i'm doing is this stone cutter is it cheaper to create stairs on a stone cutter than a crafting table or is it pretty much the same Stairs is cheaper, slabs is the same. Oh no. So all this time. <laughs> Whoops. It's just all a right. pain. You get you get one for one with stairs, whereas if you make stairs on a crafting table, you put in is it six five or six blocks? One, two, three, yeah. four, five, six, and you get four stairs, so you lose two blocks per set of stairs. Which is quite a lot really. Wow. Oops. <laughs> I know. They're like, you gotta carry more stuff. <laughs> um, I don't know where to where to start this viewing platform. It the way I've done it, I kinda wanna come out to your pillars, but that's gonna ruin it. Or I could do like a back wall or oh, I don't know. I don't think it'll I ruin it. Do you not? If it know. sort of came across Yeah, that's oh. what I, that's what I thought you were gonna do. Yeah, I, was trying, I wanted it to be back a bit, so we were looking over the whole room, but I, I just can't oh. figure out how we would get that to work. Something like that. We can see over there. Or maybe even curve it in the other way. What if you did a glass walkway? Ooh. Yeah, that looks okay, I think. Oh, that's all right, that. Do you like my little tea doorways for t- the tea for truly bedrock? <laughs> I do. I thought they were pretty. I thought they were pretty cute. You need some food. Oh my gosh! There's a creeper and I can't run. Uh oh. Ah, he's right here. He's right here. Help me. Where is he? He's right oh, in the middle. I, <laughs> I can't I've run. Got, I've got an axe. I got. <laughs> I got. I got my bow. I'm coming up here with you. I, was gonna say, I haven't got. <laughs> of course, and I can't. I couldn't run at the time because I was trying to eat. <laughs> You've got a bow. Oh, that's all right then. I was going to say, all I've got on me is my axe. That's how I carry so much stuff is I literally empty my inventory of everything but an axe and a pickaxe. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I don't know whether what I'm what doing you... here is any good or not. Just making sort of shapes and patterns with these these Let's walls. But I think it's looking a little bit weird, to be honest. It's kind of almost Aztec. <laughs> Maybe if you turn this, like this the walls are two three wide i do like to have an odd middle because it makes it easier most of the time yeah. all the stone that you're dropping um i'll just put it in this chest here oh thank you <laughs> every time i oh, run yeah, through I'm just here chucking it all on the floor aren't i <laughs> i was like why do i have so much stone i'd like to be able to hover in here a double jump would be nice i know we can get jump boost but just a double jump just to make the place in oh, box yeah. a little bit higher that'd be cool or the faster you run, then you jump, like Sonic. Oh, wow. That, yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> yeah, sold on that idea. When When's it going to be involved in Minecraft? You're your Minecraft person now. You've been on Minecon. You have to tell them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was kidding. Yeah, I got to be there whenever they announced pandas. No, no, that was last year. No, the aquatic update. That was the one. Uh, and I had I had to hide that from everybody forever, and I wanted to tell everybody we're getting dolphins oh, really? they and tritons. So I've constructed this little water fountain, which I think looks amazing. Um, all we got to do now is get some flowers in here. Let me go ahead and remove that. We'll put that there. Put this here as well. So I'm gonna use cobblestone for all of these pieces because I think it just looks better if you kind of surround the water source with a bit of stone that looks pretty decent and with all the rest of this I'll bone mill it and I'll add flowers and leaf blocks and all that good stuff and I should probably sleep because it is dark and I don't have a lot of lighting around here ah okay okay so I'm adding flowers now so um do you have 
leaf blocks by chance because that's one yes. thing i don't have yeah what type of leaf blocks would you like or would you like a selection um you can give me uh selections fine yeah i usually uh mix them up anyway you know okay i'm on it okay. if you if you need any that i don't bring oh. you they're just in my workshop over here but uh Oh, your workshop's over here. Forgot about that. Is there something down here? Oh, it's just the floor. Oh, oh nice. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're in all these ones here. Look, there so you go. There's a secret ones. compartment over here. No, it's just, again, underfloor lighting. So, and to make it look a little bit more interesting. It does. Yeah, all these shulkers along here have got the, the leaves in. Oh, we have a lot. This is where I'm at so far. And I have, like, the basic shape of the table. All the greenery is finally out. What do you think, Foxy? I think this is looking really, really nice compared to that little sort of circular weird wood thing I had going on before you got here. This is a million <laughs> times better with the pillars and the different levels and the layers. It just it really does feel like a big grand room, even though the block palette's sort of relatively basic. We've got spruce and, and stone. It really yeah. does feel big and de like full of depth and alive. It's amazing. Yeah, I like I like what you're doing with the uh, the roof there. Also, the balcony is really incredible. I'm gonna go up there and look at it. I like the glass. That's gonna look really cool. Yeah, I, I think that's coming together quite nicely. I think the stairs need a little bit of work, but the the whole sort of viewing area you can sort of stand up here and and spy on the meetings that are going on <laughs> downstairs. I guess. <laughs> there we go. Oh, yes. Oh, you can see the shape of the the table. Is the table big enough? You think? Um, I don't know. I think so. I, it, I think we're gonna struggle getting the chairs around it if it's any bigger. So I think that's probably about right, to be honest. Okay, awesome. The other thing you could do is you, you know, like when you go to a wedding or a christening and they've got lots of little tables. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> you could do that, but I, I don't think there's room for that. No, that, I think that'll be perfect. That would be pretty hilarious. Have like the fun. little reservation deals and everything. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's coming together nicely. Very good. Awesome. All right. Well, I'm glad you're pleased with it. That's all I wanted. Was your. So, what what design are you going for for the table? Are you are you going for? Well, I'm gonna try and do the pentagon shape because we have obviously that's the shape of the the entire structure. So, and I think it's great. I love it. So, and then I also want to put a maybe put like the TV um, letters in here. We're going to try and yeah. fit them in, but with this scale, I don't know if it's even going to be doable. Right, okay. So, what I've done, Miss Elaine, mm -hmm. is I've, I've made a bit of a mess, to be honest. So, we've got the original walkway coming up that you can look over, but then we've got a ledge around as well, which I haven't really done anything with. I don't know if it looks okay or not. It wow, looks what's good. it look like from down there? It looks good from here. I like it. Okay. So Honestly, probably... I kind of like it more than the glass, but <laughs> I don't you know. Think we should have... I, I quite like the glass this bit because it kind of makes it feel a bit more open. And I don't know. Yeah, I, I do. Oh, yeah. And then you can see... I forgot the gardens. I like that you can see the garden. Yeah. So I think and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some more oak fences around the other wall bits just to tidy them off and finish them off and then i just i think i'll just leave it like that maybe if you wanted to do some more gardening stuff up there or some leaves or something we can do i think once we get some stuff around here i don't know do you think i should just remove the tv honestly no i like the tv but i do think the table itself is very one colored yeah but i think maybe it needs a little bit of something in there i don't know what though oh she says she completely takes the tv <laughs> don't care what you think it's going all right okay, well, well I, I was thinking we could have like um <laughs> like i can get some banners and have like the like the draping tablecloth on it or something using banner Ooh. and a wall Ooh, that could be better that's a nice idea oh oh i like that oh yes that's better yeah. right than the tv yeah, it does. Just... It does. Oh, I do Let like that. See. Yeah. Well, that looks really nice. And it's got some nice color to it as well. I think the red really. You picked a good one there. 
it's a little snug coming in from here, but it's not really the main entrance. Uh, the main entrance is there, so that's where everyone will be coming in from anyway. Yeah, so that, so that part is spacious. Yeah. People like snuggly, you know. It's it's good. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> I think the roof I managed looks to fit fifteen. Oh, what are we gonna yeah. see? Oh, I can't bear mail them. There's no coral. Um, I was gonna say I think the roof looks pretty good from above. I love the roof. Oh, it came out good. That's the first time I got yeah, to look at it. Since... It looks pretty good from above. Well, I just I just don't know from the ground. I think it looks a little bit strange. I mean, it's very basic from above. I mean, we could add a bit more detail with a few trapdoors and some buttons and things. But um, yeah, I yeah. don't know. About you know, honestly, here, we could just weird. um. Maybe tweak the the arc, this little arch that you have, the entrance. Tweak it a little bit, and um, yeah, that needs changing, definitely. But I mean, I mean, I think that honestly, everything else looks good. I like the wall around it, and you know, do some landscaping stuff. Yeah, could work. Yeah, out. that all needs doing. There's always so many jobs with these things. Mm-hmm. It's so never ending. It never ends. Forever. I don't suppose building. you you haven't got any sea pickles on you. You by any chance? Um, I don't think I do. Let me double check, okay? Um, I should have... Oh, I have 54 sea pickles. <laughs> Yay! That's all right. There you go. I only need maybe four or five. I was just going to drop them in your ponds just to... Because it was a bit dark at night time in the corners, that's all. Just worry oh. about creepers spawning in there. Here, I have those in my other box. Thank you. You're welcome. There's four in there. Yeah, I have, um... <laughs> I hear a smushing. <laughs> it's such a weird <laughs> noise, isn't it? Yeah. There's a problem with these minecarts, Daphne. What happened? Um, <laughs> I'm at the table, miss. Can you see me? Can you see? Oh. <laughs> I, I'm in my chair, miss. I am here. I'm at the meeting. <laughs> um, I would say that they're a little small. Don't yeah, the think? chairs are a bit small, miss. I feel like I've got the, the children's little, chairs. They're a little tiny. <laughs> oh, no. You did them all like that? <laughs> well, I figured you were going to do them, like, above ground, like, here. And then I would put, like, um, some trap doors on the sides of them to keep the minecart from moving. Well, that would have made sense. I will I will do that. <laughs> <laughs> Although it would be time. pretty it'd be pretty adorable to have us all there like that, trying to look at each other. I can't other. see anything. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Just oh, like a, like a camera account looking at everybody from above. Yeah. <laughs> that would be funny. Oh dear. That was a good one. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I wish we could make emerald armor. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. An obsidian armor. That would be really cool. So you could oh, go like... Oh, that would be good. Really, really strong. But maybe like it would make you slow. I know you can do all that sort of stuff with potions, but... Yeah. It'd just be cool to have it, wouldn't it? More armor sets. Not to mention, it's just so pretty. Yeah. Um, okay. And wooden armor as well would be kind of cool. <laughs> wooden splinters would be horrible, though. <laughs> you can get them yeah. anywhere. <laughs> yeah, imagine those splinters. Oh. Okay. Doesn't even bear thinking about. <laughs> so... Here is a bit of a recap of today, and um, I have to say these these chairs though are, are super adorable. I guess I shouldn't stand on the table though, but um, so are we yeah. gonna keep these like this? Should we? <laughs> I, I can't think, find. <laughs> I think we might need to make a slight adjustment since I can't actually reach on the table to get my drink now. So uh, <laughs> that's true. That's true. Okay, some minor well... adjustments, some tweaks might be, <laughs> might be required. So yeah, for sure. So yeah, I, I we well we both decided not to to do the TB emblem. It was a little much, um, but I think the draping red uh, tablecloth is pretty good. Your idea for it. the chandelier was great, or is chandelier great. Chandelier is looking great. The table's looking great. Your little gardens are looking great. This room looks ten million times better than what it did when we came in here <laughs> earlier today. So Teamwork. I'm really really impressed. And, yeah, and the I balcony the top, is amazing. Yeah, the balcony is nice. It needs a little bit of decoration i think or something up there but it's it does it serves a purpose and it adds a bit of depth and and yeah to the room and it's nice to be able to come up here and look down so that's good yeah so we're nearly oh, there yeah. with this building the roof is on the ceiling's in the chandelier's there the lighting's all done there's the offices at the back which haven't been started yet so there's going to be 10 offices altogether, five on each floor there 
And then mm-hmm. we also talked about potentially putting in some hidden staircases behind these existing oh, staircases. Oh, yeah. That's going, going to be fun. Floor with vaults and armories and all that sort of stuff in there, which would be kind of cool. Very, so, very much. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with how it's come along. I, I, it's been a long time today, I guess. We've been recording for quite a while, but it really has made the world a difference. Yeah, a lot of time and effort was put yeah. into this. <laughs> And many, many different... And the armor stands, I love. So this one's going to uh, represent, uh, obviously, the Diamond Alliance. And then this one, the uh, the pebbles. Yeah, the pebble people. Yeah, so this yeah. is a place for uh, uniting and um, becoming one. <laughs> yep. I'm sitting at the table nicely, waiting for your dinner. <laughs> Hello! Hello! I'm not my dinner now, please, I'm hungry. <laughs> it's not a restaurant, Foxy Hotel. Uh, amazing. I say we keep the chairs this way. It's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> We'd never be able to see anyone. Yeah. We'd be sitting there going, "Is everyone here?" <laughs> oh, you see the name tags. <laughs> if, you, if you're here, say hi. <laughs> All right, so we're back in the shopping district, and it has been a long time for me since I've been here. Like four or five days. What? Oh no, the riots are moving. What does this say? We shall report this to Shades. Shades. And yay, cool. So we sold some more iron. Iron seems like it's not as in demand as it once was. Haven't sold too much of that. I guess I'll start selling chicken again soon. Let's see here. Okay, yep. Iron is really slowing down. So um, we'll try and sell that. Um, hopefully we'll be able to sell it soon. But at least we made 16 diamonds. Anybody buy any books? No one bought books. Okay, so we have made a small profit, which is great. But that, I guess, for the most part, um, oh, I got that shulker box. We need the other yellow one. <laughs> I should probably color, color coordinate these a little bit better. Okay, so let's turn some of these into uh, blocks here. Okay, so yeah, business is still go is still going good, still booming. Sixteen diamonds is not too shabby, I guess. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's episode. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. I had a ton of fun. Um, anyways, as always, I love you all. I'll see you next time. Bye!